I was always interested in making things and building things. And uh, since I was a kid, I was mechanically inclined. Um, so that was really the initiation. Uh, Captain Moult was established in September of the 2012. Uh, prior to that, uh, there was two other companies. One was Prozen Moult that I founded in 1996, and another company called Cat Tooling. In 2012, we decided to put the two companies together. Uh, that was mainly to expand. I wanted to expand and grow Prozen Moult. And for me, the fastest and the quickest way was to merge with another company. Well, Captain Moulds is a high quality uh, plastic injection manufacturer. Uh, we specialize in uh, caps and closures and uh, very intricate uh, details. We make high quality injection molds for uh, uh, a niche uh, market of customers who require very long run times, very fast ejection speeds. I like to think that Captain Moulds is technologically advanced. Uh, we have an innovative approach to, you know, problems. Uh, what we do that's different than other companies that we're not afraid to take a challenge. Well, some of the equipment that we have here is uh, very specialized, whether it be software or the machine tools. And we're able to machine parts that uh, are very complex and would require uh, many more setups by our competition. Uh, with our high-speed uh, milling machines, we're able to uh, machine right down to tools about 10,000 of an inch in diameter, which allows us to achieve uh, a lot more detail in the, in the finished component. Uh, we're a very teamwork-based culture. Uh, we work with one another every day across departments. Uh, we're often communicating about jobs uh, to speed up our production times. Uh, uh, whenever we do have problems, we often get into discussions with one another and, and come to kind of team-based solutions. Well, the environment here is uh, very uh, high-skilled, high-demand. Uh, everybody that uh, is currently employed uh, by Captain Moulds is uh, college or university educated. We are connected with George Brown College, Sheridan College. Um, I basically contact them and I let them know that we are interested to hire a recent graduate. Um, I graduated from George Brown, so I have a you know, soft spot for George Brown. So I was introduced to Mastercam at uh, George Brown College. They have a CNC department there where they kind of teach you the, the ropes on like how CNC works, uh, the, the underpinnings of the programming, and then they, they get you to use the, the processes that Mastercam makes available and easy. Well, I've been uh, a Mastercam user for, I believe, 21 years now. And uh, at the time, going back then, uh, again, CAD CAM, CAD CAM systems were uh, somewhat in their infancy and uh, we needed a solid platform uh, to work from for a job that we had uh, in the shop and uh, we had to start somewhere. So we uh, looked around at the different packages that were available and Mastercam seemed like the logical choice uh, to go to. Well, Inho Solutions obviously was the distributor for Mastercam and uh, we've experienced an outstanding relationship with, uh, with in-house uh, from a sales standpoint, uh, from a uh, customer service standpoint. Um, if we have any issues, uh, they, they break there to help us out. The 21st century demand for product is, is it has changed. It has changed very uh, fast. In the last 20 years, uh, molds that are required today they don't look anything like the molds that used to be built 20 years ago. Uh, well, looking to the future, I see uh, manufacturing becoming more and more demanding. Uh, I think the focus will uh, be predominantly on uh, tighter deadlines, uh, lower cost and higher accuracy. Uh, these are things that are important to uh, our customers and uh, they need to be successful in order for our company to be successful. Uh, so it is a changing industry and it is sometimes a challenge to keep up with the demand and the pace of technology. I mean, new uh, methods, new softwares come and it's available, but for human, it's, it is hard to uh, keep the current demand and meet those expectations, but also upgrade and update your knowledge base based on what the new technology is for the 21st century. Thank you.